It is my pleasure to address this forum. President Muhammad Buhari held the attention of all at the third plenary as he delivers his speech. He focused on wooing Japanese and international investors to Nigeria. Our government is implementing homegrown and private sector driven economic measures that are predicated on good governance, infrastructure, and human capital development, as well as business climate reform. We therefore invite the private sector to come and invest in Nigeria. On behalf of his government, he gave this assurance. We are committed to removing all impediments to private sector participation in these sectors by creating policies that will ensure consistency, predictability, and a level playing field for all. The day's itinerary include a bilateral meeting with Prime Minister Shinzo Abe. Thank you, Prime Mr. President, um, you know, talked about the challenges that uh, Nigeria is facing, the terrorist challenges, the support of uh, Japan through the UN with the humanitarian uh, challenges uh, that we have. Governors of the president's delegation believe the conference has been fruitful. So it seeks into the objective of Mr. President. It also seeks, you know, with the growth that we are aspiring in Lagos, so it just means that we can unless all the contact, all the opportunities that are available, right, and take them back home and be able to say to our people, our thoughts are also part of the global talks. Most of the aid from these organizations here from Japan have been going to East Africa. And it's because of the attitude from West Africa. We're not proactive, we're not coming out, we're not being aggressive. You can't just sit at home and expect people to be trained when they're You have to show interest that you're interested in aid. You want to work with the Japanese companies. Next, President Buhari received an official of the European Union. A memorandum of understanding was signed. The EU is promising additional assistance. They are increasing this. Uh, by 50 million to 562 uh, 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 million uh, uh, euros, actually. And, um, and of course, uh, Mr. President welcomed this. And um, the large part of this monies uh, will be devoted to the Northeast. This ties with the expectation of Governor of Borno State. We are trying to address some of the root causes of the insurgency. And that is why we are looking for support from the Japanese government in terms of creating jobs, especially in the areas of technical and vocational education. Ticket 7 enters its last day tomorrow with more engagements lined up for President Muhammad Buhari and his delegation. From Yokohama, Japan, Ibrahim Adra, reporting for Channels Television News.